All right, does anybody even need 400 miles of range in an EV? That is the subject of this video. Well, I'll tell you, my theory is that nobody needs it. Tesla's doing a great job keeping up with superchargers. You know, there's an the infrastructure of high speed, rapid speed uh, chargers. They, they seem to turn over well. There's not really any real long waits on these things, especially with the 80% uh, automatic default that they've put in, which is easily overridable, by the way. And I have videos on how to hack that. Search the channel. But in terms of, you know, just having long range, the average driver only drives like 30 miles a day. Why would anyone need 400 miles? I mean, even me, I drive lots of long distance driving, okay? Lots of long distance driving. And, you know, the big thing with charging is, uh, I mean, I guess it would help if you had fewer stops, but I don't want fewer stops necessarily. I want to get out. I want to stretch, take a break, go to the bathroom, okay? That kind of thing, get something to eat. A long, long range, what that's going to do is basically make you stay in your vehicle even longer, longer than you probably want to or need to. That's the benefit of it. Who's actually going to take advantage of that? I think pretty much no one. Let me know what you think in the comments. You know, um, it's great that the ranges are so long that it's not even an issue anymore, but it's just longer than anybody even needs now. I got 260 miles of range on this, at least on the factory, 259 on my 90. 90D Model X. That's more than enough. So let me know what you think in the comments. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, hit the thumbs up and the bell for notifications. And we will see you in the next video.